Hi everyone, my name. Okay, we're gonna start with um, the levels by Happy Wolf 69 Okay, there's only one level we gotta play. It's called the Wizard's Castle. This is Wizard's Castle and he trapped you, so you need to escape and kill him. Pfft, the wizard is a nerd pretending to be because you played so much World of War. That is a lot of caps lock right there. I should remove that. Click the red wall to skip. Let's not skip. Meanwhile, I get to tell you guys that um, two things. One. I'm sorry for the short episode today, but you gotta do school stuff, which is quite important, so I'm doing a shorter episode so I can spend more time that. Um, in two days, my holiday will start, so that will allow me to make better and longer videos, so um, yeah, now you know that. Second thing, I'm gonna do a Q&A soon, so if you have any questions for me, leave them in the comment section below, and the Chains of Doom just trapped me. But yeah, if there's any any burning questions you guys have for me, then uh, let me know. How am I? Is there is there a tactic for this? How well does this work? Ah, okay, let's get to the point. I've trapped you here. I noticed, and you have to complete my course. And you will have to face me. Ha 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 ha. Dad, will you play Minecraft with me? Shut the fuck up, son. Okay, I gotta admit this level is kind of funny. Um, okay, let's just take it slow here. That should work. There we go. Is this like saw or something? After you enter that magic lift. That magic lift. And, oh. Oh, okay, okay. Let's try it again. I think I'm pretty stuck. And now we go against the wall so that we bounce back a little bit. Nice, nice. The nerdy squad. Oh, okay, he's dead. No, I don't have anyone to play World of Warcraft. Wait. Click the red square. We don't want to get stuck there. There we go. And up we go. And right we go. I what will that say? Something with harpoon. Okay. I um uh, yeah. I made sure that the harpoon didn't hit me. Now I, I want. Uh, I don't know what he said. What am I supposed to do here? Jump. Oh. Okay. That's a weird position. You shall not pass. <laughs> it doesn't look like it indeed. I got a sword. Wait, oh yeah. I forgot to do that. Uh, we're almost there. That's nice. Don't drop the sword. Okay. Okay, I got it with me. We're gonna kill we're gonna kill someone with the sword. Let's let's do this. Aw. I made my sword into a chair. Uh, we're gonna give it a few more tries. You are in the way, Mr. The Nerdy Squire. I don't- Shit, I forgot to click the red square again. Luckily there is a warning. <laughs> that helps. Okay. Um, harpoon. Nice. It's almost impossible for the harpoon to hit me, I think, because of the dots. Okay, jump. Perfect. Nope. Okay. And I shall pass. Yes. I didn't pass, but okay. So that level was pretty simple and short, but though, even though the humor in that level was pretty cool. I I I kind of like that level. Spend a lot of time on it. I rate 7 out of 10. That is nice. Next up is Mortal Kombat X by Dan Dare 74. Looks a little bit like the Mortal Kombat X trailer. But here Sub-Zero kills Scorpion because why not? I hope you like it. Okay, I have no uh, experience whatsoever with Mortal Kombat, but um, yeah, let's, let's, let's play. Okay, so it's, it's just a simple animation, but it looks pretty cool. You gotta push the ball forward and yeah. Okay, so the only thing I can rate here, I guess, is the detail and the way it's animated. And that is, that is pretty cool. Um... Yeah, there's not not much to say about this one. I'm not really gonna rate it. It wasn't really playable, but nice. It looked nice. So there's that. Happy Wheels Together, one of the members of the Matchy um, project. 
one of the members of the Match Shape project. And um, we're, go we're gonna start off with Baumage the Red Soul 2. Find and push the buttons to activate the same colored elevator. Oh, okay, there we go. That is so awesome. That is, yeah, that's cool. So this is just a, a whole trigger level. Let's um, finish it. Okay, so we gotta go to the blue. That is green, Rick. That is not blue. It's late, okay? Don't 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 judge me. It's late. Oh oh oh. Okay. And now we've got uh, the orange one. Now we go up. Beam to the third part. You can beam. Oh jeez. Okay, we made it all the way here. Oh, so this is probably going to get locked soon. Oh, there we go. Oh boy. Yes! I made it. Um, the art style is pretty awesome. Um, simple but pretty clever level. I rate 7 out of 10. That was nice. Matche spellbook. <laughs> okay, so... Um, you probably already have uh, seen Matche play this one. But um, this is pretty much an awesome level. Look at this. We got a boss here. Click, click the tree rapidly. There we go. Found died. You found page one. Boat. So that's a spell. And uh, we're gonna go pretty fast. Look at that. That's a boat. Best day ever. Oh, oh, it's me. Of course, next to the boat. You gotta like click me rapidly. There we go. Magic eyebrows. That's um referring to Matt Shea. Guess that is a guy's reference, probably. Guys has created a level called Starving Hobo, so that could be a reference. And this takes ages. <laughs> I'm not clicking that fast though, so yeah. And ah! oh, we found page three, Whispered Hat. Now we gotta go all the way back. The cool thing about this level is that you can fly in some way. I love the water animation on this one as well. There is just so much about this level that I like. The only thing that could have been better is that it's not really challenging, but yeah. You kind of forget about that when you're playing this, because it, it's just overall, it's an amazing level. I haven't seen a lot of levels that are the same style, like a pixel themed level. I rate 9 out of 10, that was so cool. I think there's barely any Happy Wheels author who can make something like that. Okay, here's the Baumage D. Ratzel. Ra Ra Etzel. Um, I think I already played this one as well, but I'm not sure if that was for the uh, playing and rating subscriber levels. So we're gonna play it. And I think this author will be the last one in this episode. Again, sorry for uh, a really short episode. Oh, oh, I thought I didn't activate it yet. It was just really slow. Again, sorry for a quite short episode, but yeah, I just have to work on some stuff uh, and then tomorrow is the last day of school for me so you know after that I will have more time okay we wait here there we go and here oh oh was that bad whoa there's a lot of paths in this level that's pretty creative is this going up it is then we go back. Again, this is one of those levels that is pretty cool, but it's not really, like, challenging. The art style is amazing, uh, with, with the colored walls that just have a lot of shading on them. Um, so I didn't trigger this yet, we gotta go back. But, uh, as you can see, there's not, um, my chances of dying are so low. The only way I could possibly die is probably just by throwing myself to the ground. But yeah, that's that's a small thing. That's all I can say about this level, pretty much. Um, and it's very repetitive, maybe. So, this one's gonna get a good rating. Definitely. Happy Wheels Together is an amazing author, I tell you that. Be in the second part, there we go. So, we played the one before. The part two. We just did. I rate 8 out of 10. That was a cool level. Great job. This is not a level. There is no level. 
Oh, this is uh, this is referring to there is no game because there is no level. Don't touch anything. There is level. No, what have you done? There is level. Let's press this. Damn! There is a level, and we found the level. Boost. Oh, hmm. You see, is it collapsing? What's going on? Standard colors everywhere. Oh no, we don't want that. You need to find the art tool. That is very creative. So cool. Okay. Can we find the art tool? Watch out. Oh, you found it. Now pick it up and save the world. Again, I'm pretty sure we have already played these levels. We're playing them again. Just to make sure. Damn it. There, oh, there is no sun. Because he's dead. Yeah, yeah. There is no sun. There is sun. There is a sun. There is a god. Boom. You see? You see? Standard colors everywhere. A green screen behind me. The art tool to find. Um, you know, everything. Okay. Okay, we're not gonna fail this time. Um, we failed this time. There is no... Don't touch anything. I touch this button if I want. I touch this button if I want to. There is a level. There it is. The game this is based on is pretty clever. So, I like the level itself too. You see? Standard colors everywhere. I only see one color. Okay, let me find the art tool. Um, we speed up this time. We speed up. There we go. And now watch out for the wall. There it is. Now something awesome is going to happen. Pick it up and save the world. Let's pick it up. Yay. Art everywhere. Very fair. And it has a finish line animation, which is pretty cool. I would rate this level a 6.5 out of 10. It was very simple, but I like the concept and the idea. So, cool level. Cookie Clicker. This one is really famous. <laughs> uh, I saw a YouTuber play it, but I don't really remember which one it was. Do we have um, enough costs then? Can we buy it? We can. Now goes a lot faster. Okay, we're almost at 100. And I think we are now able to buy it. There we go. Look at how fast that goes. That's great. Now we gotta go to 500. And... Now we can do 20 cookies per second. Yeah, that goes a lot faster. <laughs> if you are done, click here. It's, it's still going. Happy Meals Together, Toby. These guys are so amazing. That is so awesome. Did I finish the level? Is there no finish? Well, it doesn't matter. It's okay. This level is amazing. Like, it's probably one of the best copies of a real life game. I rate this level 9 out of 10 as well. Thanks for watching. I hope you liked the episode. Sorry for making it so short. Now keep in mind, if you have a question for me, and please ask it in the comment section. I will do a Q&A soon. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time.